Okay, I'm logging in as a normal Alfresco user here. And the first thing I want to do is kind of find out who is also using this server. So I'll go into the people finder. And I happen to know that all of my test users are named test something. So I'll search for test. And I can follow these people. So let's follow the odd numbered test users. And now when they take action, um, I'll be notified that they, that they do something. Let's look at test user five. We can actually see who test user five follows. So it looks like test user five follows me, test user two and test user four. If I go into my own profile, I can see who I'm following and I can see who's following me. So test user 1, 2, 3, and 5 is following me, and I'm following test user 1, 3, and 5. If I want to keep people from knowing who I follow, I can just mark this private. But let's go ahead and leave it public for now. No one can see who's following you. They can only see who you're following if you choose that option. I'll set a little status up here in my profile and I'll log out. Now let's log in as test user 5 and go into the product launch site. Navigate into a folder here and I can like documents that I see. I can either like them from the document library list or I can pull up the details and like them from there. I can mark documents as a favorite and I can see comments but in this particular site I don't have access to comment I'm just a consumer in this site so let's log out and log back in as someone who is able to make comments in this site test user 2 go back into the product launch site document library test folder And I can like documents, of course, but now I can also comment on documents. And you can see the comment link. Let's go ahead and just click on this one. This is a picture from DevCon Berlin last year, I think. Add a comment. Now, let's say I wanted to share this picture but I want to share it with people who don't have access to this site. So this is a feature that came to us from the cloud. I can do, it's called a quick share. I can share it, get the link, copy it to my clipboard, and now let's log out. And I'll just paste it into my uh, browser here. And when I visit that link, I can see the preview for that image. So just a way to quick share a file with somebody. And then if I log in, if I happen to have the credentials to uh, be able to log in, then I will go back to the details page for that particular file. And then when we're done sharing, we can just turn that off by doing an unshare. All right, let's log out and log in as myself. And now, we can see that um, the activity stream tells us when different people take action and I can filter that to only show me the activities of the people that I'm following. It's important to note that I'll, I will also get an email um, with uh, the activities of the people that, I've that I'm following. 